Hello and welcome to the fourth day of my 30 day exercise challenge in trying to maintain positive mental health while in lockdown. If you missed the first video, here's the link to that. Uh, you can watch it if you want. Uh, this is the second video. We are now in my home here in Italy. And if you're wondering why it is so echoing here, it's because this morning James and I have removed all of our furniture, of all of our belongings from our lounge as we are going to redecorate this space uh, over the weekend. So if you watch this video till the end, you will see what our room will look like after we've done that. And as you know, uh, while in lockdown, we spend a lot of our time in our homes, so we decided that it will be good um, for us, for our well-being, if we make this room as nice as we can possibly do, as it's a rented place. And I'm sure that our dog Luna is going to be involved in all of it, because she's a very nosy little doggy, she wants to be involved in everything that we do. Um, so you'll see a lot of her too. Come here, Luna. Come and say hello. One of the best things about being in Italy in winter is these little things. So they are called persimmons. And the only other place where we were able to eat them this um, ripe is Turkey. Um, so every time I eat them, it reminds me of our time in Turkey. Uh, they're amazing when they're like really, really soft. And I knew that this was coming, so I've been looking out for them in the shops um, since the beginning of the month and I'm just going to enjoy one now. Mm. Really, really good. That was good, wasn't it? It was pretty fun. Lots of room for interpretation and improvisation because it's quite difficult to follow the moves the first time. Uh, but I had a lot of fun and uh, yeah, I'm feeling actually a lot better now. I was okay today, but not in the best, best of moods. And um, I feel like that was a really fun activity to do and I feel a lot more smiley as you can see and sweaty. <laughs> So yeah, I'm very happy with that. That's the first time I did the Zumba uh, home workout and approved. Last night was a bit rough. I think I got a little food poisoning, but today I'm feeling a lot better and hopefully feel good throughout the day. I'm actually on my way to a little cafe that's just around the corner from our house. Uh, I think they're shut now for cafe business, but they still have their pastries uh, for sale. So I am going to have a look and see if we can find any.
think about that. Very nice. Thank you, James Roy. Autumnal platter. It's very calm and still. You can definitely feel how the life has slowed down a little bit in everybody's homes. Mm. Over this side, they still catch the sun this time of day, so they've actually taken their washing in up the top there, but everyone's had their washing out. And on this side, people are putting, doing jobs. There's an aircon unit going boop in over there. but I'm very happy that I did and I did because I have I have promised that I'm gonna do it and also you're watching that um, so I had to do it and yeah I feel so much better for it I just feel normal again I feel like mine is centered I'm not scattered I'm not chattered I just feel like I have a bit more energy even surprisingly um, yeah, I feel good. So just a reminder for myself in the future. The times when I don't want to do the exercise is probably the most important time to do it because it's gonna make me feel better. Yeah, just starting it is the most difficult part, but this was not strenuous exercise, it was just a little bit of stretching, but it did its magic. So yeah, good. And I'm just gonna go now. I'm gonna say good night. Night night. See you tomorrow. I still need to do the exercise, so I'm very glad that I did. Very proud of myself. 
Are you proud of me? I am. Give me a high five. <laughs>